anomalously fun fact, all dinosaur nuggets are made of dinosaurs. No, not because chickens are evolved from dinosaurs. That would be pedantic. I mean, literally. I mean the group of interest Ambrose Restaurants found a time vortex and has a trade secret agreement with every company that makes dinosaur nuggets. Dinosaurs weren't killed by a meteor, they were factory farmed to extinction. Don't believe the propaganda. So many of you tagged me in this video, and I appreciate your concern, but this is not abuse of SCP-999. This is just its weekly massage. Notice the squish squish sounds with every pat, that's how you know it's working. You're going to fight it, aren't you? Regrettably, yes, I think I may be about to do that. It's really big. I've seen bigger. Really? Are you joking? It's massive. Robert, why are you still playing that stupid game? I don't even understand the point of... Uh, no, you don't actually have to explain. Wait. What's going on on the screen? Robert? We decided, you know what? Let's do what no one else has had the bravery to do. Salt popcorn with real human tears. Well, that settles it. Science has officially gone too far. I quit. I'm joining the Global Occult Coalition. I get this, you have to exist. Oh, damn it. Is he all right? Yeah, mate, he'll be fine. He's just had a massive night. That's it, mate. Get it all out. It's his own fault. I told him not to do those shots. Yeah, well, he's already paying the price, Bill. Lay off him. Y'all know this is fake, right? Son of a... Okay, I admit, I did not believe that you could disinformation campaign a literal giant eating a roller coaster train full of people in broad daylight, but they believe it's fake. I owe you a drink. SCP-5886 appeared in a bed at Site-42 on October 7th, 2014. 5886 is also known as James Biggio. The entity seemingly and suddenly developed a higher perception of time. This granted the individual super speed. It is believed that 5886 left Site 42 on August 18th, 2020, when the Pegasus Rising Project successfully opened a wormhole for five microseconds. The stay must have felt like multiple eternities. When I mention a less commonly known SCP, a lot of people in the comments will say, Hey, can you link that to me? How do I find it? And I really don't mean this rudely when I say it, but Google it. 99 out of 100 times, it'll be the first result. Just make sure you confirm that it is SCP Wiki dot because that's our real site. If you see something like Amino or Monster Wiki or Fandom Wiki, that's not us. It's probably not canon. Memetic entities eat? always duplicate. Whoa! I'm Hypnotic vegan. eyebrow waggle. Very new well. variant, new power, I see. Careful. It's a persimmon. It is, in fact, a persimmon. Who told them the persimmons existed? They're not supposed to know about persimmons. It's doing Narnia closets now. What can I get Whoa! Today? The entity may bite. Put that in the logs. May I? This has real white women travel Instagram vibes. Spatial anomalies intact. Milk necklace. All right, wrapping up the test. Don't cross the brands! When I heard that there was a new Coney Hawk variant, I had to race over to the skate park to see how my old friend was doing. But I have to admit, I was a little tentative about this whole wet floor sign gimmick. But after seeing it stunting, you know I had to respect the drip. This reminds me of an SCP, but TikTok's gonna get real mad if I tell you about it. Here's the SCP number and the title. Google the SCP number. Don't Google the title! Remember, folks, if something awkward happens during one of my open duets, I was recorded, you made it weird. Toodles! Today, December 1st, 2021, is the beginning of what will be the greatest and final TikTok profile picture cult there will ever be. The SCP-096 Cult. I say final because SCP-096 famously unalives any individual who sees its face. That's right, we are burning TikTok to the ground for their ultimate crime. Not verifying Dr. Blue and myself. Am I being a bit petty? Of course. But don't you want to watch this app burn just a little? Your instructions are simple. Change your profile picture to 096's face and comment on videos as you normally would. Perhaps leave the cryptic. Site 42 requests that you join the SCP-096 cult. Today we do not secure, contain, or protect. We release. 
let loose, destroy. I'd like to make myself believe. DJ Khaled! Another one! I understand that teaching the tree to play the accordion was a marvel of scientific progress. But listen closely, if the tree isn't screaming, I don't give a flying- Before I begin, allow me to preemptively apologize, because based on the tone of your response, it seems like my reply to your comment had a little more insult than I had intended. You asked me if there was any help getting into the SCP fandom and lore, and my answer of no was only slightly exaggerated. Of course, me and other SCP TikTokers and YouTubers act as a sort of gateway to the SCP community because we put our content where you are rather than having you come to the SCP wiki itself. But of course, we're not putting out SCP stories themselves, we're putting out content based on SCP stories, and specifically, the ones that we believe will get views on our platforms. Of course I do content that explains some SCPs and concepts behind, but I can't give you as much detail as actually going to the site. When I say nobody can handhold you into the SCP fandom, I mean that the same way I do for any other. If you ask someone, hey, how do I get into the Harry Potter fandom? They'd say, read the books. So when you say I've already tried diving in and can't find shit, I have to ask, how many SCPs and tales did you read? What SCPs did you go in looking to read about? Some people choose to start at the beginning of the archive at SCP-002 and try and read through everything. I don't suggest that, it's not terribly interesting that way. Many follow us content creators and then if they find an SCP that we mention that's interesting, they go look it up on the wiki. Some people camp out the top rated new pages part of the site so they can see the best new SCPs that are coming out every day. Since I don't make a Site42 YouTube video for every SCP I read, I know I've read at least 700 SCPs just myself. And I got into this fandom before the content creator boom. Back in my day, there was only Vulgan, Gmodon, and Dr. Cool. In line with the old adage, we content creators have led you to water, but we can't make you drink it. That's up to you. And just like the legend says, the Keyblade War will begin! Shut up! All right, all right, all right, you cool Josie the Half Cats. This is DJ V. Sherm bringing you the smooth stylings of SCP-1000. Child murder isn't funny. It is when you say it like this. Child murder. <laughs> this is what happens when you go against my wishes. I read a theory once that the human intellect was like peacock feathers. Just an extravagant display intended to attract a mate, just an elaborate mating ritual. Maybe it doesn't matter that we have accomplished so much for the basis of reasons. But of course, the peacock can barely fly. It lives in the dirt, pecking insects out of the muck, consoling itself with its great Attention site personnel, I regret to inform you that the SCP-049-J Pajama Party is currently taking place in the lounge. Is there anything better than milk and cookies? Universal healthcare. Mommy baby. You're what? I'm mommy baby. You're my baby? Yes. And I'm <laughs> fucking cute. SCP-999, when blended, tastes like orange dreamsicle. I am absolutely by no means sanctioning this test, but the documentation shows that SCP-999 smells like a different pleasing odor for any person who interacts with it, which causes me to hypothesize that it would have a different flavor for each individual as well. Chimera, no! That's my boy. No, my boy! Father hell! Hey there, Site42 fam. It's come to my attention that not a lot of people know that we have a Site42 SCP merch store. We've commissioned art from multiple artists to make SCP-related merch, and we've got stickers for the Site42 channel. And so if you want some SCP merch, as well as helping support the Site42 channel, teespring.com slash stores slash Site42. Thank you in advance, and cheers.